Hey guys, Anthony Taylor here, uh, aka Hoots on uh, the old Twitter, and uh, I've been asked by the uh, Frosted Cakery folks to show you the proper way to eat a French toast and bacon cupcake. Now, if you've never had the French toast and bacon cupcake, it looks like this. Uh, it's pretty much amazing. Uh, you got the French toast cupcake, uh, the maple uh, buttercream frosting, and then two slices of delicious, uh, incredibly well-cooked bacon uh, right on top. Now, it is a tricky cupcake to eat. There's really no wrong way, of course, to eat the cupcake, uh, but this is the way I like to do it. I take the cupcake, and you unwrap it a little bit there, and you want your first bite to just pretend like it's just a normal cupcake. So I like to go in and get a little bit of the frosting and the cake in the same bite, okay? It's so good. Crazy delicious. Now here's what I got to do. Take the wrapper completely off now. Okay? Put that aside. Take one of the pieces of bacon. Set that aside. You're going to eat that later. That's going to be like your dessert. It's like your savory dessert to this thing. Then I like to take the bacon out and then kind of mash it down like that. So now I'm getting slices of bacon and buttercream frosting and French toast cupcake. You guys are so good. I'm not gonna bore you making you watch me eat the rest of it. You gotta go down and get your own, get your own frosted cakery. That's on with Sean. Totally delicious delicious. You can follow him at on Twitter at Frosted Cakery. I'll go ahead and put the Twitter handle up there. Um, yeah, that's it. French toast, bacon, maple buttercream, cupcake. That's what heaven tastes like. You're my cupcake. Um, drop, snickle, 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 sn